Good morning everyone, welcome back here to my backyard garden. So today I'm going to show you how to deal with your bottle guard plant disease and pest control organically. So this is my growing bottle guard plant. So as of now, I noticed that my bottle guard plant and fruit has some pests and disease so i'm going to show you shortly so this is so far my a very young bottle guard plant here or fruit so as you can see there are some punctured or kind of like um little holes in it and i just noticed it that there were some like a little caterpillars or worms around the fruit because you could see their skin has some punctured on it and then afterwards I check on their leaves I see some scattered worms or caterpillars as well so I'm going to take a close-up look for you to see these are pests this is my first time to encounter this kind of pest in my bottle guard plant and I believe since it's been raining and it's summertime that's where the time that the plants or the garden really suffer from pests and as you can see also I have some um, immature um, fruit that starts to die I believe it is because of it's been raining too much or it can also cause by fungal disease is really aborting um, young female flowers that can be a mature bottle guard in the future so today I'm just gonna cut and prune the leaves of my bottle guard plants you can see there are some scattered caterpillars and this time I'm not gonna compost it because I don't want to spread it to my compost bin so I'm going to throw it directly in a trash or in a separate um, a garbage so yeah if I think you visit your bottle guard brush often you will notice some changes as you can see on the leaves and fruits because they're kind of tiny and I think for bottle guards since they have huge or big leaves it's better if you notice them early because there were some worms that um, can damage the fruit the leaves and the stem as well i do have some split stem i believe it's a blight or from raining too much lately so i still have one um, bottle guard from the last time that i have rested and i'm going to um, leave one for seed and so far that's how I um, deal with my bottle guard plant disease so I don't uh, spray anything so I think just being uh, mindful with your bottle guard plants while it's still growing and checking the leaves the stem and the fruit will give you lots of hint if you don't want to use any chemical or um, pesticide you can hand pick them and um, pruning your bottle guard help to prevent any further disease or a pest because it, I believe that you can control it before it get worse any um, rotten um, tendrils or stem you can cut it out prune it throw or cut the leaves already ahead and don't let the caterpillar spread to other um, vegetables so there you go guys that's how i care for my bottle guard uh, plants and you can apply this also if you bottle guard plant has uh, disease or pest but if it's really really very severe um, i think um, cutting down or even removing your bottle guard can be an option but if you can save it I think you can but I believe that once your bottle guard plants been producing a lot already 
sometimes uh, the plant um, become sick or develop disease afterwards so there you go guys thank you for watching and listening to my channel if you find my video helpful please subscribe so you don't miss any video in the future see you next time and bye